Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel and in this video I will show you how to fix PCSX2 adder. Please insert a PlayStation or PlayStation 2 disc. Whenever I try to open my any disc or PCSX2, so you can see This error is showing. Now I try boot ISO fast. And this error is showing again. Please insert a PlayStation or PlayStation 2 format disk. So how we can fix this issue? First of all guys, you need to check your disk for your PCSX2 you are using. And if you are using right disk for your PCSX2, then you can change some settings for your PCSX2. As you can see, I have two different disks for my PCSX2. So I have same game, but in different version. I open it and I have uh, uh, this one, as you can see, uh, GTA Voice City Stories. And I have this one. GTA was uh, stories so I have same game and size is 4 gigabytes and uh, this size is one and a half gigabytes you can see if you want to know about your disks you are using in your PCSX2 and go to your disk and right click and extract to and wait for some time after extracting we have a new folder for this game. Now open this folder and as you can see this game is for PlayStation 2. So you can use this disk for your PCSX2. Now I go to another disk. There is this one and I extract it and wait for some time. Now open this folder and this disk is for PSP emulator. So do not use PSP games for your PC SX2 emulator. So you can use this disk in your PSP emulator or PPSSPP emulator in your PC. Now I have PPSSPP emulator for my Windows, but first I want to use a right disk for my PC SX2 this one so this disk is right for my PCSX2 emulator now I go to system so there is no option to select my right disk on my PCSX2 emulator now go to configuration and change your configuration setting if you want to select right disks for your uh, PCSX2 otherwise go to C DVD and select ISO selector and check this option ask always when booting now go to system and go to boot ISO or boot ISO fast. Now we can select right disks for our PCSX2. Go to desktop and select your right disk for your PCSX2. And click on yes. And here we go. As you can see the error has been fixed. Game is working. Now I close it and if you want more settings then go to CDVD and select browse and it's done. And if you are confused while selecting any ISO file then go to CDVD and ISO selector and clear ISO list and yes. Now go to system and you can select any ISO you want to use and one more important thing guys. If you want to use PSP disk image file, as you can see, PSP game. So you need this emulator, PPSSP, for Windows. So I hope this tutorial will be helpful for you guys. If you like it, then please subscribe and like my this video. Thanks for watching guys. Bye bye.